I'm talking here with uh, Jeff from Avid, and tell me about Avid Everywhere. Well, Avid Everywhere is something that we came to the industry with a couple years ago, and it really uh, represents our strategy. Avid Everywhere is really how we're looking at the company strategy, and the first thing we're looking at is what are the industries facing? What are the problems we're facing? How do we help the industry solve those problems? You know, and, and so Avid Everywhere is our vision about you know, the company's strategy and how we're going to help the industry face these issues uh, as an industry. Part of that strategy is our platform strategy, the Media Central platform. And over the last couple of years, we've been talking a lot about the platform, a lot about our openness strategy, and it's been going quite well. In fact, recently we've just announced that uh, in 2015, we just completed that year, and we had platform adoption up 54%. So the number of units sold in, in Media Central platform was up 54% in an industry that obviously is, is at a much slower growth. Um, and so we've seen some great adoption of the platform. Uh, we're seeing great success stories with how people are using the platform around the world, and there's a lot of great examples of that. Well, well that's certainly a paradigm shift, shall we say, right? It is, it is. For Avid, it was a big shift because you know we're known as our heritage as being a company of creative tools, and well, that's still a big part of our business. It's more than that. It's also about how we help media enterprises or any type of enterprise that's trying to, you know, face the challenges of our industry today, the whole idea is to help people look at the entire picture, their business issues, their technical issues, their operational issues, and how through a platform strategy can we help them address these most pressing problems. But also, creative processes are part of that platform and part of that of what we're doing today. So it's a big shift. Now, you have a lot of users that, uh, that dial in or go to your Connect conference. Tell me about that. They do. So uh, Connect is part of our Avid Customer Association. So two years ago, at, in fact, at NAB, right before NAB, we launched the Avid Customer Association. At the time, we had like 150 members that we started out with. And since then, it's climbed over 5,500 members of the Avid Customer Association. And Avid Connect is the biggest event of the year that we do where we bring all of our community together to literally connect with each other and connect with the company and and, and as a community, we look at those industry pressures and we come together and talk about those. So is this, is this training or is this uh, user information feedback? What is this? It's all the above. So at Avid Connect this year, uh, we obviously have big sessions where Avid talks about the company and the update and the product strategy and we unveil new products actually at Avid Connect before NAB. But a lot of the time is spent in networking events, in informational events, training events. This year we had over 40 tracks with uh, over 50 speakers from the, across the industry who came to share information about different things. We look at the technology of media, we look at the business of media, we look at helping people refine their craft, we even have tracks around how to get your career started. And so it's been a great success. This year was a sellout. We had uh, over 1,300 people registered for the event and had to stop taking registrations because we had no more space at the event. So it was a great Well, success. that's really incredible. So, so just tell me what type of uh, craft people uh, come to this event. All the above, we see um, people that are TV or film editors, we see people who are sound mixers, or even in the business of creating music. And so that's a lot of the craft that we see, but we also see a lot of people at the technical level, at the operational level, and a lot of business management people come to the event. And are you seeing people outside uh, broadcast and movie? Absolutely, I mean, you, obviously you see the classic companies, but you also see people like Netflix and Hulu there, um, or even people in other types of industry where they're using you know, media for communication or for information purposes. And so it's uh, it's more than just television and, and broadcast media. You guys are definitely on the right stream for sure. Thank you. Well, thank you very much. Appreciate the opportunity.